I know people who taught here for AS style, but I hadn't heard about any classes for a while. So I emailed the um, person in charge of the continuing education department, and so he said, "Well, nobody teaching right now, so come and teach classes." So my personal journey in learning sign language was started when I was one year old. My mom found out that I was deaf and uh, the doctor told her to that it would be better for me if she put hearing aids on me and taught me how to speak and not sign to me at all. But she she's a school teacher and she felt like there was something wrong with that. And so she went to classes and she learned all the signs. She come home and teach you or teach me. And then eventually later I made the choice to also learn how to speak and how to read lips so I could communicate with the hearing world. AL style is always the best language to start with. And it's totally okay to give a child or a full person to get a cochlear implant. They do help a lot. It's a wonderful tool. I'm grateful to have. I have one. It's just I want people to understand the importance of AS style in a deaf person's life and how it helps them progress because they have communication. Here in Clarksville, there's so much interest for people to learn AS style and that makes me excited. So that's why I'm here, that's why I want to teach. The most helpful thing a hearing person can do for a deaf person is to communicate, make the effort. Um, treat them like a normal person. You can either choose to be a victim and feel sorry for yourself and not progress in life, or you can choose to rise above and overcome. Once you do that, the sky is the limit. There's no limitation for a deaf person. For more videos, visit Clarksville Now on YouTube.